my name is Elias Kitan, and this is my project, Sugar the Silent Killer. Before I start off, I would like to thank the Price Pottinger Nutrition Foundation for choosing my project. The reason I chose this particular project is because obesity is becoming a major problem. Studies have shown that obesity has more than doubled in the past 30 years, and more than one-third of children are overweight since 2010. Obesity brings many health effects, some being immediate or some being long term. Immediate, immediate health effects include cardiovascular disease, bone and joint problems, and social and psychological problems. Long term health effects include heart problems, type 2 diabetes, several types of cancer, and arthritis, and can ultimately shorten your lifespan. This is where my project comes into place. I tested to see if students knew how much sugar they were actually drinking in sweetened beverages in sweetened beverages, and the purpose was to show that students are not aware of how much sugar they are actually consuming when drinking a sweetened beverage. The way I tested this was by gathering 66 students and testing each one individually. I showed them 6 beverages that students drink daily. Coke. Gatorade, Starbucks Frappuccino, Rockstar Energy Drink, Arizona Iced Tea, and Lemonade. I then showed them what one gram of sugar was and told them to put how much sugar they thought was in each of the beverages into a cup. After they poured how much sugar they thought, I weighed it in grams and I wrote it down in my logbook. After I showed them the actual amounts, they were all shocked and couldn't believe it. Even before, even me, before I started this project, I didn't know how much sugar there was in, there actually was in a bottle of Coke, and now I look at Coke and I just see sugar. My results showed that students are not aware of what they are actually drinking because out of 396 total chances that students got, that students could get to the actual amount of sugar, only 8 of them did. This matched my hypothesis because 98% of them did not know the actual amounts. This is due to the fact that companies don't really tell you how much sugar a person is actually drinking in one beverage. For example, it might say that there's only 10 grams of sugar in one serving, but in reality there are 6 servings, so you are actually drinking 60 grams of sugar in only one bottle. And another problem is that people do not know how much sugar you how much 60 grams of sugar really is. Let me show you. There is 65 grams of sugar in Coke, in just this bottle. There is 35 grams of sugar in this Gatorade bottle. There is 45 grams of sugar in just this bottle of Frappuccino. There is 62 grams of sugar in one Rockstar Energy Drink. There is 51 grams of sugar in one Arizona iced tea. And last but not least, 67 grams of sugar in one lemonade. And it's supposed to be healthy. You can imagine. If I were to hand you a spoon and say, eat this, of course you wouldn't. But that's the same thing you're doing when you drink a bottle of Coke or lemonade. Just people don't know what is, it, what is actually inside 
that's inside what they are drinking. In conclusion, students are not aware of what they're actually drinking, and this leads me to know that more awareness has to be created in order for everyone to understand what is truly inside beverages that they drink daily. That is why I'm glad my project was chosen, so people will see what they are actually drinking and will lead them to live a healthier and better lifestyle. Thank you for listening.